tensions are rising as the standoff between the world community and the rogue North African nation of Wadia intensified today as UN weapons inspectors were once again refused access to the country by Wadian leader, Admiral General Aladin. I will take no options off the table, and I mean what I say. Tonight, we ask, who is General Aladin? According to Wadian propaganda, Hafaz Aladin was born in 1973. He did not know his mother, who died in childbirth. General Aladin was born the only son of the Colonel Aladin, himself a savage and violent dictator. Known for his iconic beard, he is protected by 30 female guards, who he maintains are virgin. Thrust into power at age seven, he may just be the most dangerous man in the entire world. All right, let's get right to it. Do you have nuclear weapons? <laughs> what was the question? Do you have nuclear weapons? Sorry, I can't hear you. Are you developing nuclear weapons? No, I literally can't hear you. I'm going to another question. Oh, I can hear you now. Eccentric and with unlimited oil wealth, he recently hosted his own Olympic Games. On your mark. Get set. <laughs> At which he won 14 gold medals. Often described as ignorant, he changed over 300 Wadian words to Aladin, including the words positive and negative, causing mass confusion. Do you want the Aladin news or the Aladin news? The Aladin news? You are HIV Aladin? With pressure mounting, Aladin addressed his nation today. shall kneel before our great nation. We are two months away from enriching weapons-grade uranium <laughs> to be used for peaceful purposes. <laughs> it will be used only for medical research and clean energy. It will, it will, and will certainly never be used to attack is, oh boy. Oh. And with that speech today, the international community is asking one question. Does the mad dog of Wadia have nuclear weapons? No. Show me my nuclear weapons, I can't do it, I can't do it! <laughs>